Hi, my name is Brian King. I'm an independent Stampin' Up! demonstrator, and welcome to StampWithBrian.com. Today I'm going to share with you one of the oldest techniques in the book with perhaps a new twist. It's the KISS technique! So come on in and let's stamp. For today's project, we're going to be using hardwood background stamp and this leaf from For All Things. The KISS technique basically combines the two images into one. So what I'm going to do for, to start with is I'm going to uh, ink up my background stamp with a little early espresso. And I'm just going to knead it in a little bit of that spot. I'm going to ink up the leaf, which is a solid image, in crushed curry. And then I'm going to kiss the two together. I'm just going to press this down lift it up, and then stamp it onto my cardstock. And what this does is gives a beautiful image of the two images together. Now I know that you could stamp the hardwood and then stamp the leaf over top of it, but you're not going to have the beautiful shape of the leaf around it. This is called the kiss technique. Now you can easily do multiples of this, but if you do, I want to suggest that you clean your stamp every single time. Make sure you have your stamp and scrub handy because otherwise you're going to be transferring this early espresso back onto your crushed curry pad and nobody wants that. So the next time you sit down to craft, think about the kiss technique. What images do you have that are solid that you can mix with pattern to create a beautiful new image? Thanks for stopping by. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. Please join us over at stampwithbrian.com to see what fun we're having over there.